Hello, Joe here from Infinity of Tacoma. Today I'm going to tell you about this beautiful 2022 Tesla Model 3 dual motor long range that we have for sale. This is one beautiful vehicle. In fact, it's pretty close to new. You can only get a brand new Tesla from a new Tesla dealership, but this only has 11 miles on it. Uh, so virtually it's brand new with 11 miles. In fact, it's so new, it still isn't done calibrating. Uh, all the cameras in, on this vehicle need to calibrate. So you need to drive it for a little bit and it's still not at that point of 11 miles. I think you have to, it takes maybe 40, 50 miles to fully calibrate the vehicle. Um, so basically you're getting a, a nearly new Tesla. Uh, you know, the warranty goes in effect the first day it was registered. Um, so why do we have this Model 3 long range of only 11 miles on it? Well, just keeping it real, uh, you know, new Teslas, depending on the model, it's a six month to a year wait. So for a brand new one, uh, so obviously there's a healthy demand in the used car market. So someone, not us, someone uh, ordered a brand new Tesla and with the intention of uh, flipping it and making a little bit of money, we purchased this on the wholesale network, um, you know, for dealerships. And then we have it available for retail. That's, you know, the way the world works, uh, you know, when there's premium vehicles and there's a limited supply, you know, it's all about supply and demand. And it's not just Teslas. Uh, there's a lot of uh, you know, gas-powered vehicles uh, out there that are, you know, have a very strong demand in the pre market. Like, uh, if you want to find a diesel version of a half-ton Chevy pickup or a diesel version of Suburban, uh, very hard to find. Uh, for electric vehicles, Rivians. <laughs> Rivians, are, uh, I've seen, are on the wholesale network, are going for almost double MSRP. Uh, the new Hummer uh, uh, EV. Um, the new Hummer that just came out. I saw one on the wholesale network for two hundred sixty thousand dollars. I think MSRP was like one hundred ten thousand. So it's all about supply and demand. Um, you know, some people might get upset about it, but it's just uh, you know the way the world works. Like when a new iPhone comes out, there's demand for them, and if you don't want to wait and order a brand new one from Apple or you know AT and T, you want to buy one on eBay or wherever you're going to pay a premium for it. And, that's the way it works with Teslas and a lot of other vehicles that are in demand because, you know, there is a big supply shortage, uh, which is driving up, you know, car prices. Uh, you know, two years ago, we had a hundred brand new Infinities on our lot. Now we have four or five new, new Infinities. So, you know, just goes to show you there's a limited supply of everything. And then, you know, take that supply chain issue with electric cars and then throw in crazy gas prices. Uh, the more gas prices go up, the more the demand for EVs go up and it's not slowing down, you know, and people take risks. I mean, you, you who are watching this video, you could go to Tesla's website right now. I think it's $250. You could order a model three or model Y and take delivery six months to a year from now and you could flip it and make some money possibly. But you know, there's always risk involved. Uh, you know, who knows where the world will be six months to a year from now. So chances are, you know, the demand will be very strong, but who knows, uh, you know, obviously what's going on with the housing market. Uh, a lot of people were flipping houses and making money with the housing market, but now it's starting to, to stutter and slow down. So that's just the way the world works. Um, <laughs> take it or leave it, but let's talk more about this specific Model 3. Uh, so the Model 3 long range dual motor, uh, the 22 model has a range of about 350 miles fully charged. Uh, it's also very performance oriented, 0 to 60 right around five seconds. Top speed uh, over 130 miles an hour. Uh, it has dual motors, so you have a motor in the front and the motor in the back, giving it all-wheel drive, so it does great in snow and wet, slippery conditions. Uh, it also makes it very fast uh, because it's having all-wheel drive. This thing just grips and goes. Lots of amazing safety features. Um, you have autopilot. I'll show you a video of me driving a Tesla on autopilot. It uh, allows the vehicle to steer within its own lane and move with the flow of traffic. A really cool system. It uh, is included uh, automatically in this vehicle. You don't have to pay extra for it. I know a lot of people ask about full, about full self-driving, but full self-driving is still in beta. It's not there yet. You, you can buy full self-driving capability, but you're really not at that point where the car can drive itself. It'll get there eventually, but the autopilot works great now, and you don't have to pay any extra for it on this Tesla. It is included. All right, so the majority of the functionality is in this screen. Um, keeping the interior very nice and sparse, nice and empty. Uh, it's almost like a sensory deprivation chamber, how nice and 
clean the design is and there's not a lot of clutter. It's also very quiet. This one features a Tesla's new uh, Tesla glass, double pane glass. Um, there's a, a sound editing material sandwiched in the middle of these uh, double pane glass, making it very, very quiet. Excellent cameras, cameras all around. You can actually pull up uh, your cameras yourself in sentry mode. Uh, if, a, if your vehicle is vandalized, uh, you know, sentry mode will record it. There's also a uh, driving camera, so if you're in an accident, uh, uh, you can put a USB port, a USB uh, stick into uh, this drive and it can record video for you. Maybe you just want to record video for whatever reason, nice road, or maybe you see someone driving crazy or whatever reason. Or uh, you can set it up so it'll automatically uh, record uh, like the last uh, 20, 30 seconds before and after an accident so you can see what happens, prove it's not your fault. So the Model 3 is considered a compact uh, luxury vehicle. It's along the same size as like a BMW 3 Series, Mercedes-Benz C-Class, or our own product, the Infiniti Q50. But not having a traditional transmission tunnel, an engine, drive shafts, allows the interior to be very flat and spacious. Has a lot of interior space for a small car. Doesn't actually feel small on the inside. I'm six foot two. I fit very, very comfortably in there. Lots of extra storage. Normally here you'd have like a gas tank or a spare tire, but uh, you have extra storage in an already fairly large trunk. Uh, we all have a power lift gate or power trunk uh, that was recently added in 2021. They refreshed the interior also in 2021, making the 22 uh, Model 3 a good choice. You have a nice wireless charging pad, uh, redesigned center console, a little bit extra wood trim on the doors and stuff versus the earlier uh, Tesla models part of 21 and 22. You also have more range on the 22 model. In 21, uh, they added a new octo valve heat pump, which greatly improved the efficiency of the vehicle and the range. So uh, the earlier Model Y all-wheel drives had a range of about 310 miles when fully charged. Now we're over 350 miles of the 22 models. And near we have a frunk giving you extra storage uh, and it's also a safety feature normally you have an engine here so without an engine here you have a crumple zone that's about 60 percent larger than a, a gas car so you have all this space here to absorb crash energy in a frontal collision in fact if you go to tesla's website they have a special page dedicated to the model 3 because it's actually one of the safest vehicles ever tested by the nhtsa pretty much by every metric they have uh, one of the lowest probability of injuries in the accident. A uh, big part of that is it has a very, very low rollover risk. When a vehicle rolls over, that really greatly increases your chance of severe in uh, injury. But the fact that this has a battery pack that's fairly heavy, but the battery pack is so low to the ground, this vehicle has a very low center of gravity, so it's very, very hard to roll over. In fact, if you manage to get it to roll over on its roof, the weight of the battery will flip it back on its wheels. It's almost like a keel in a sailboat or one of those, you know, punching clowns. Just the weight of it will just put it back on its wheels. And then uh, it's not just a safety feature, but having that low center of gravity makes this thing handle pretty amazing. It, it uh, Driving an electric car like the Model 3, uh, you really can't compare it to driving a gas car. Gas cars can be fun and fast, but the Model 3 is a completely different driving experience in its own right. Uh, in a lot of ways, it feels a lot of high tech. It's almost, you know, using an iPhone and going back to a, a flip phone. But obviously, you know, flip phones are, you know, just a phone. Or, you know, gas cars can be fun. It's fun driving a loud V8 manual transmission car. But when it comes to daily commuting, safety, efficiency, you know, not using gas, uh, you really can't beat a Tesla Model 3. They're one of the most efficient. And I think uh, it's probably the best electric vehicle on the road. Uh, Tesla has been working on battery technology for a very, very long time. I think they're five to ten years ahead. Pretty much anywhere else as far as battery technology goes. User interface, design, uh, I think software. Tesla uh, is leading in a lot of ways over their updates. Then we have the uh, amazing Tesla mobile app. Uh, so here's this vehicle. Right there I can uh, pull up the controls. I can set the climate control. I can preheat it or pre-cool it. I can pull up the location if I'm not driving it, see where it is, or if it's in a parking lot, I don't remember where I parked. You schedule maintenance, I can pull up security cameras, I can check the charge status, I can buy upgrades, I can schedule service, roadside assistance, it tells me the exact mileage and VIN number. Uh, it's amazing. 
Uh, there's nothing <laughs> like the Model 3 on the road. It is uh, an amazing vehicle, very unique. I love Teslas. Um, we do really well with pre-owned Teslas at Infinity of Tacoma. We always have a great selection. And thanks so much for taking the time today to watch this video.